Teenagers are under arrest and are now facing serious charges for this brutal attack. Victims kicked, punched, tackled on Squanum Point Park Pier in Quincy last month. Julie McDonald is live in Quincy for us tonight with a closer look at this story and the charges. Julie? Well, David, everyone involved is a juvenile. All of the victims and suspects between 14 and 17 years old. When we came back here to the scene tonight, we didn't have to tell anyone about this video. The disturbing images are all that neighbors have been talking about for more than a week. I didn't spill any water. We're walking. Walking. Just one of the disturbing parts of this July 31st fight on a Quincy Pier is that the brutal attack was recorded on camera. But thanks to video evidence, it didn't take long for state police to identify the seven teenagers who now face a slew of charges. I personally think that there's more to the story than the video shows. Investigators say what the video does show is seven attackers punching and kicking five victims, as well as preventing the young teens from running away. And you can see in the video too, uh, one of them tried to jump off the uh, pier up here. Um, and that like surprised me and that showed to me like the level of fear that um, the one group had put into the other group. The seven juvenile suspects are between 14 and 17 years old. They're mostly from Quincy. One lives in Kingston. It's, it's a shame. You know, you see people that age, you know, they can, they have their whole life ahead of them. You see something like that, it's just, it, it, hurts, it hurts your heart. I mean, to see people grow up in this community, even people you probably knew in that fight, and it's just a shame. Squantum Point neighbors, though relieved the suspects have been identified, say the whole situation has left them disgusted. It doesn't belong here in, in the public parks. We have like, little kids here. But, you know, people walk their dogs every day, and it's just totally unacceptable. Now, these seven suspects face 18 charges each, including assault and battery with a dangerous weapon, even kidnapping. State police say there could be more suspects and additional charges. Live in Quincy tonight, I'm Julia McDonald, WBZ News.